name is Harrison Caton. I'm from, uh, originally I'm from Southington, Connecticut. Um, I just recently moved down here for school and uh, am a resident of Broken Arrow. Uh, currently, right now, I'm a, making a living by being a server, um, though I have my IT degree. So if I could choose something to do if I didn't have to make a living, it would probably be a personal trainer um, and teach other people how to lift, primarily doing the barbell movements of squat, bench, deadlift, and then furthermore doing the uh, barbell movements of the clean and jerk and snatch for Olympic weightlifting. So I first heard about the hub when I was uh, looking online for a gym uh, to go to that was, had the availability that I needed. and. This place being 24-7 with the key card access was, sounded really good to me and uh, checked out the gym and found that I worked out for what I needed. So something that kind of sets the hub apart from other gyms in the area or uh, that I've worked out at before is that they do have the equipment that you need, um, whether it be bumper plates if you're doing more of like the CrossFit, Olympic weightlifting, that sort of stuff, they have that sort of thing. As well as like you're able to use chalk, you're allowed to make things get a little bit messy, you're allowed to bring in your own equipment, um, and you're allowed to make a little bit of noise too, which sometimes places don't allow that, so it's good. My favorite part about working out at the Hub is that they um, have the equipment that I need and that uh, even if you're working out by yourself, they have things that you can do that you can still do the movement safely um, and still get all the work in that you want to. So the main thing that keeps me working out is that I want to get very good at the sport of powerlifting. Um, I love the sport, I love the way it feels, how uh, you have to learn the movements and get better at them and how uh, it allows you to push and compete against yourself every time. So the craziest thing that I've ever done is I went rock climbing, um, free rope, in November up in Connecticut when it was like 30 degree weather and the wind was blowing, my hands were going numb and I was, uh, the rock wall that I went out on uh, did not have enough handholds and footholds. So a couple times I nearly fell. So that was probably the craziest thing I've ever done.